welcome to Avanti House. This presentation gives you an insight into our school and we hope that you make the application to join us in the future. The presentation comes from various areas of the school, each highlighting three key things. First of all, the educational excellence. We have outstanding results that really do give your child that chance to blossom and reach their full potential. We also have the character formation. You will hear from all parts of the school in the way in which we support your child, making sure that they develop over time and have a very bright future. Opportunities such as Duke of Edinburgh, the Combined Cadet Force and the Colleges and Houses give you that chance to really blossom and flourish as you stay with us all the way in through until year 13. And finally, you hear about the spiritual development. Every child has a spiritual journey and a pathway which gives them the opportunity to explore their own future spiritually amongst others and amongst all children in the school. We welcome you and we look forward to hearing from you in the future. Avanti operates like a family. We're not a chain of schools but a family of schools and that's really important to us. Our size and structure enable our staff to make a real difference not just in their own school, but across all the schools within the Trust. My name is Mr Jani, I'm the Head of Science at Avanti House School, uh, which is quite an honourable position because I'm absolutely passionate about science. Everyone has a strand, biology, chemistry, physics, uh, I'm a physicist, we're a rare breed. At Avanti, in the science department for Year 7, it's about getting them comfortable with not understanding everything, but having that hunger and thirst for a curiosity and a desire to keep moving forward through the subject. When they start their seven year journey with us, they broach into the third skill, which is investigative skills. So we teach them about health and safety in the lab, how to do their basic experiments, about all the different pieces of equipment. And that sets the stage throughout the rest of their year. For our younger years, we've got things like Young Science Journalism Society at the moment, which has kind of sparked quite an interest. So they're talking about epigenics, they're writing about the multiverse, which was absolutely brilliant and quite topical if you're into your Marvel films right now. My staff are very personable their role models, and they develop really good relationships with the students. To the point where we do end up, and it sounds geeky and nerdy, but the truth is we do end up talking science when they come into the science corridors. We talk about things that are currently happening. Students will bring up topics that they want to discuss that might not be taught in the content, but are still science-based. And I think building the year sevens especially into that culture that we already have here is really important. And I think being immersed in it, they'll naturally just fit in. And most students, if not all students that come here, effectively become part of our science department in that way. My name is Mr Patel. Um, I'm head of maths at Avanti House Secretary School. Maths at Avanti House is uh, very interesting and very enjoyable. Um, it's enjoyable for me um, to teach it to the children. Uh, and uh, the children reciprocate in the same way. So our GCSE results are pretty much up there in the top 5% of the country. And the reason why that occurs is because the team are so dedicated to providing for the students. We, we sort of, uh, we will put all things aside just to make sure that the learning takes place for the benefit of the student. I am Miss Vasudeva and I am the Head of English in Avanti House School. You're going to join us as little 10 and 11 year olds and you're going to leave us as 17 and 18 year olds, young adults who are ready to join the world, to be independent, equipped with all of the skills we teach you. You're going to be critical thinkers. You're going to be confident to be able to articulate your thoughts and feelings. You're going to be able to speak eloquently publicly and privately, you're going to be able to express your opinions, your thoughts, your ideas with intelligence. And most importantly, you're going to be a good human being. The literature we have chosen to teach you in year 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and all the way through secondary school, it's literature which is going to develop your key skill of empathy. Some of the trips we've had in the past that students have really enjoyed is we've gone to the open air theatre in Regent's Park to watch plays and we've gone to lots of theatres all around London. In addition to taking you out of the building to enjoy and experience the world of literature, we also have lots of people come into the school from theatre companies to poets to writers. So we have lots of opportunities for you to enjoy. I'm Mr. Reniga um, and I'm the incoming head of Year 7 at Avanti House Secondary School. So the transition from Year 6 to 7 can often be very challenging and quite unnerving for students. 
But I think what we do at Avanti is really special. We really make it seem enjoyable, fun, and as a team and as staff, we're all here to support you. We have loads of amazing events, activities, and days to help you come together, understand what high school is like, and really get to know everyone. And everyone's so friendly, everyone's so kind, welcoming. And I think it's really, really special, and I think you, you should really be looking forward to coming here. My name is Mira Agawal. I am PRE teacher at Vantia Secondary. PRE stands for Philosophy, Religion and Ethics and it is a subject which underpins the unique aspect of Avanti. PRE is Avanti's bespoke offering to our students where they can explore happiness, identity, spirituality through open-minded discussion and study of different philosophies. PRE is one of a kind because it's not learning about religion, it's learning about yourself. Who am I? What makes me happy? What's my purpose? What do I stand for? Hola, I'm Mrs. Sadwani. The students here know me as Senora Sadwani. I'm the head of department for languages. So they are very keen when they come in year seven because sometimes some of the students already have some languages in primary. Uh, but we assume that, you know, we start from the beginning. We try to consolidate any previous learning and, and start with the basics so that we make sure they've got a strong foundation. Um, and they are, as I said, very excited to do languages. So uh, we have French and Spanish. They are allocated in one or the other language. And uh, we encourage them to do lots of research projects uh, on celebrities, movies, uh, you know, cinema, the schemes of work are very linked to topics that they might find uh, appealing. We also are very lucky to have an ICT suite and uh, also very resourceful, so lots of resources online. Uh, so they are very, very keen on languages, uh, you know, and being creative. My name is Miss Devalia and I am the head of art at Avanti. In Key Stage 3, we teach them um, the basics of art and this is predominantly in Year 7 and we have um, two booklets for each rotation and in the first rotation for year seven we will teach them the formal elements so looking at the basics of art looking at line texture pattern and then in the second rotation we look at the color theory um, in year eight we will then use that basic information and we will then introduce an artist so we introduce Picasso and look at the movement of cubism and in the second rotation for year eight we look at the day of the Mexican dead and that's when we introduce different cultures and traditions from the world. They enjoy every single project. My name is Matthew Domine, um, I'm an assistant principal but I'm also uh, the lead for artistry which is music, dance, drama and art. My main subject that I teach is music. All students study music in year seven, eight and nine. We make it really fun and exciting by studying a wide range of topics and we use a wide range of instruments ranging from African drums to ukuleles to traditional Indian instruments such as tabla and we do lots of singing and keyboard work too. For students in Avanti they're really fortunate because they get to study a broad and exciting curriculum here in humanities uh, ranging from rivers and volcanoes in the physical world and geography um, and in history they have an exciting trawl through medieval history both here in Britain but also in Africa and in the Indian subcontinent too. The meals we offer are pure vegetarian but we link those with the Indian diet and the Western diet. Uh, amalgamating the two, so the infusion of all the spices and herbs and tastes uh, actually bring the dish alive. The children are then taught how that happens, they know where the food's coming from, uh, we try and teach them as much as we can uh, and it really, really works. I think it's an amazing family feel, the schools really do work together, the primary and the secondary schools, there's a real feeling of inclusion across the whole of the trust. But in terms of in the school, it's a school really based upon those, those pillars that really do enable all children to really reach their full potential, but also strive to be not just academically doing well, but also kind of to develop their spiritual insight, but also really grow within themselves. I'm Andrea Khan, Assistant Principal, Senko Leading on Inclusion. What's so special about the Vanti Schools Trust and Vanti House School in particular is the fact that based on the ethos of the school and the spirituality, we can work with students to remove all barriers for learning and ensure they can excel both academically and in terms of their character formation. We pride ourselves on a really strong transition programme that starts from year five into year six and straight through to year seven. 
We do a whole range of activities, ranging from speaking to previous schools, to questionnaires for parents and to students. We make sure we get them the biggest uh, developed picture about that student, so when they join us in year seven, we know a huge amount about them. That way we can ensure they can settle in, we allocate the form groups accordingly, and we can also provide teachers with lots of information to ensure they're happy and settled. We also closely monitor all the students that join us. We have regular pastoral meetings and wellbeing checks to make sure the students are happy, settled and thriving at Vanty House.